This video explains how to remove file extensions from a file name in the R programming language. So without too much talk, let's dive into the R code. In this video, I will show you an example and this example is based on the vector of file names that we can create with line three of the code. So if you run this line of code, you can see at the top right of RStudio that a new vector object is appearing, which is called my files. And we can print these file names to the bottom in the RStudio console by running line four of the code. And then you can see that our vector of file names contains three elements and the file extensions that you can see in this vector are .csv, .xlsx and .txt. Now let's assume that we want to remove all of these file names from our character strings in the vector object. Then we can use the file path sans ext function of the tools package that you can see in line six of the code. And within this function, we simply need to specify our vector of file names that we have created before. And then I'm also storing the output of this in a new data object that I'm calling my files new. So if you run line six of the code, you can see at the top right of RStudio that this new data object is appearing and we can print our updated file names to the RStudio console by running line seven of the code. And then you can see that we have created a new vector object, which contains the names of our files without the file extensions. That's all I wanted to explain in this video. In case you want to learn more on this topic, you may check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on my homepage, I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can find it there. If you have liked this video or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. I'll try to respond to all comments as soon as I can. Furthermore, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notified about future video releases. I have already published about 500 videos on this channel and I'm releasing new videos on a daily basis. Thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next video.